All right, so our DMs are open at Ben and Kelly Show. You can always uh, shoot us a, a message, and we'll turn around, toss it out to our listeners, and see if we can help you out. Yep, Dana said, hey, Ben and Kelly, can I slide into your DMs really quick? Okay. I've been with my boyfriend for almost 10 months, but learned something big about him over Thanksgiving. Mm. He has a 12-year-old son. Okay. He never told me. All right. His son is in boarding school, came back for break. He was with his mother during the summer in New York. Mm. I couldn't believe he held such a big secret from me for so long. I mean, I knew he was married before, but why not tell me that you have a child? Yeah. There's nothing major about my life that he doesn't know about. I figure 10 months is enough time that most of that stuff should be out all in the open by now. Mm-hmm. He disagreed and said that he's excited for me to be surprised. What? <laughs> I don't get this approach, and I don't get keeping this a secret. Wow. So now I can only think of what else I don't know. Uh-huh. Is it time to go? Like, is this a major red flag or just strap in for the next big bombshell? Oh, wow. What well, already sounds like Dana is, I is she's going to need some time to process this because... yeah. I mean, that happened just a little bit ago. Yeah. And and I, I agree. Like, you know, when he's sharing the whole, hey, I was married before, you also include in that sentence. And I have a kid. I've got a 12-year-old son. Yeah. Yeah. I don't understand, especially 10 months in. That should be revealed at the beginning. I Yeah. I Like, part of me thinks... Is he, it's one thing to be like guarded about who your children meet if you are in a, you know, uh, in a new relationship and you don't want to bring like new people around your children all the time. Right. And so I get that, but. Yeah, but you should make them aware they exist. But, but I'm saying that wasn't even a thing according to Dana where. Yeah. His kid wasn't even around to, right. like, keep Dana away from his kid. Exactly. But but I think meeting the children and knowing about them, two very separate things. 100%. So, yeah, totally understand. Let's not meet the kids until you know it's a solid relationship and you think it's going to be, you know, for the long haul. But let's let's tell. Let's tell the new people we're dating yeah, that we I, have children. I, like, part of me thinks, is he ashamed? Like, I, I, is he embarrassed that he has a kid? Like, that that doesn't. Doesn't excuse it. It does. It no. it, it just it doesn't c- compute with me. Yeah, it doesn't with me either. I I do not understand the thought process behind not saying anything at all for ten months and and surprise. Yeah, and our text line is blowing up. Like uh, Jennifer says, just his child doesn't come up in conversation, and then last ten months. Yeah. Run. Yeah. Uh, Kim says, does he not have any pictures of his kid around the house? Yeah. Yeah, and if he flag. doesn't, then what the hell? Like, yeah. like, like what I, kind of I, an absent father is he? Well, and I get the fact that, you know, physical pictures aren't as huge a thing as they once were. Everything's digital, right? But Okay. Like at the same time, ah, I just, just I weird. don't see anything in my brain that can reconcile not telling your girlfriend of 10 months that you have a child until now. Mhm. Now, again, Meeting them is different. Sure. N- knowing Again. about them. Yes. I think needs to be a thing that is discussed. Yeah. So Hananiah said definite red flag. Uh-huh. You know, one man or woman doesn't have another child on a regular basis and, you know, stay quiet for 10 months. It's kind of weird. I dated my ex for two years. He knew I had four kids, but he never met them. Yeah. And my boyfriend now I've been dating for seven months still hasn't met them. But again... They know about them. Yeah, exactly. That's it's different meeting the the kids, meeting the spouse or or the boyfriend girlfriend, and knowing about them. Exactly. Yes, so, we, sh- we should have revealed this in our little get to know each other fun fact session. Yeah. So Dana should have been included. I think I don't know if you do strap in for the next big bomb show because I, I don't think so either. I I don't see this is really like a gigantic neon sign red flag. 
Yeah, because if, if, you know, obviously he doesn't have custody, which, you know, I, I get, you know, a, a man doesn't necessarily have 100% custody of, of a kid, if, especially if he's in, if he's been divorced, but. And has been in New York all summer. Yeah. With mom. Like, I just doesn't I just, sound like he's very present in his son's life. All right, which, well, what is that going to mean if you guys have yeah, kids down the road? I don't yeah. know. I don't know. Dana, I, know, I know we're really making judgments on a little yeah. information, but still, that's that would be too big of a red flag for me. Agreed. Dana, okay. sorry, that's I, I think we're confirming what you already knew. Yeah. And you're not as crazy maybe as you think. And yes, probably time to go. Yeah, Amy says no pictures, never mentions this kid. Run. Mm-hmm. There you yeah. go. Perfect way to end that. All right, Dana, thank you. Keep us posted. Dive into the DMs there.